Hey everybody, we're Diamond Too Loyal back again with another video. Today we're reacting to another Illuminati video. Prisoner escapes jail for Valentine. What happens is shocking. Let's get into it, guys. This video was once again requested. Melissa, sweetheart, I'm finally out. After being stuck in that tiny cell for two years, I'm not letting another Valentine's Day pass us by without you being at my side. Now, if I could only call you. I can't say that. Yes. Excuse me, sir. I'm so sorry, but I really need to use your phone right now. Please, sorry. sorry it's, it's bad, I can't help you. You're literally using it right now. How could it be dead? Sorry, sorry. I can't help you. Have a good day. Please, it'll really, take Really, he's on minutes. the phone Maybe and he's gonna say it's dead. Well, thanks for the help, bud. Okay, okay. Just keep your cool, Dom. The hard part is already out of the way. You broke out of prison. Walking 30 miles, that's not gonna stop you. Maybe it's better this way. It'll be a surprise for my love. It's been two years since I've seen her after all. He broke out. Finally, a normal Valentine's Day after- And she probably got somebody else. What if he get there and she got somebody else? For so many years. Happy Valentine's Day, babe. Hey, happy Valentine's Day, sweetie. Oh, she got her some uh, handsome so chocolate. To spend this day with you. She got her some handsome chocolate too. Okay. But um, there's something I think you should know, and I think you're gonna want to sit down for this. Please take a seat. Don't tell me you have more work. No, no, nothing like that. Just, I just think you should know that Dom. It's no easy way to say this. Don broke out of prison. What? How? I don't know. It's all over the news. Apparently, he cut through a brick wall with a toothbrush. Oh. We don't need to worry. It's over the news? I'm so scared. Jacob, you don't understand. When Dom went to prison, I cut him out of my life. I don't want anything to do with him. Dang. Look, I, that's fair. I mean, the guy did get a life sentence for trying to stab someone, and you had a lot of courage staying away from him. But he wrote me letters every day, and I didn't even read them. I burned them. He is going. So to now she's scared. I feel like if she really wanted to end it, why didn't she just write him and like tell him that she don't want to, you know, continue the relationship? Shoot, at least he'd know. Come <laughs> for me. I understand. Look, and the rare chance that he comes and finds you, don't worry about it. I'm here, and I'll protect you. Aww. Is that cookies I smell? Yes. See, now, what is there to stress about when we have cookies? Man, let's get some cookies. I'm home. Oh. I promised you, Melissa, I'd be back for you no matter what. Oh. What? No. No, no. Please, yeah. no. He moved on, man. Is this Melissa? You found someone else? Is this why you never wrote me back? Yep. No. No, I can't. It's not her fault. The next morning. That's a pretty unique door. I like that door. <laughs> oh, he was still in the house. I had a feeling. It's just me. It's just me. I'm back. No. I'm not gonna hurt you. Dom, what are you doing here? I made you a promise, didn't I? I'm not about to break it. Our love brought us together. But, you know, after I saw you with that guy in our bed, 
That was like a stab to the gut. But none of that matters. I, I don't blame you, okay? I, I know you needed... You needed somebody while I was away. I'm sorry. Dom, you killed someone. You really believe that? You've known me 12 years and you actually think I'm the kind of guy to do that? No, I don't know. So she chose to believe whatever she heard, however she heard it. But he like, I don't know. I want to know the story now. Melissa, that wasn't me. That was just a big misunderstanding, okay? And none of that matters because all I want is to be with you. She don't want to be with you. She moved on. You, you don't believe me, do you? Dom, there's a reason why they gave you a life sentence. They know that you are guilty. You had the knife. I told you, I was set up. You have to believe me. And he probably was set up. I kind of believe him, y'all. Like, I, I believe that he was set up. I mean, it's so easy for, you know, somebody that was set up to still get life in prison because, I mean, it happens. It really does. It really do happen, though. Because it makes them look so guilty, you know what I'm saying? Look, meet me at our park at noon. I'll explain everything. What are you doing? I, um, was looking for my ear- What? Oh, alright. Well, if you can't find them, then I don't know what I'm gonna do with these new ones I just got you. Aww. You don't want to let him go. Come on now. She has to come. And I hope she don't break up with this, the new dude for her ex out of prison because, I don't know, he just seemed like a sweet guy. Like, you playing with his emotions at this point. If our love was real, she will. Love always finds a way. Melissa! <gasps> you came. We're gonna have to make this fast. I literally ditched lunch plans with Jacob to be here. I don't want him to get suspicious. Did. She did. So lunch. he doesn't know. No, and if he knew, the cause would be all around here, and rightfully so. Hey, hey, hey! No, 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 no! Don't do that, please. Please. You came here today because something told you I was innocent. I don't know how I'm gonna prove that to you, but I promise you, I will. This is serious, Dom. Yeah, I know. So then, tell me what happened that day. Well. It's, it started just like any other day. I was getting ready to buy you flowers the day before Valentine's Day. I knew it was smarter to go the day before, you know, to avoid the big lines. I just wanted to make Valentine's Day special for you. So as soon as I walk out of the store with the flowers and some groceries, someone comes running behind me with a bunch of cash they just robbed from the store. Their face was fully covered and they were wearing some thick heeled combat boots. I don't just want to let them get away. I want to be a good Samaritan, but we struggle for a bit, right? The knife goes flying and stabs an innocent bystander who was just trying to help. Ah! Uh. I try to help, but it's too late. Before I know it, the cops have surrounded the whole place. I've been accused of the murder. Ah! Uh. I've been away from you ever since. That's not what they said on the news. Yeah, well. Those cops were desperate to arrest anybody they could, out of fear of looking incompetent. Has there been any crimes that fit that same description since I've been in prison? No, just petty theft, not violent ones like this. I gotta figure something out. You gotta oh, her boyfriend. Melissa, what are you doing here? No, you stay back. Listen, I can explain everything. Just, no. just give me a minute. No, 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 no. no. Please, 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 please. Too, a lot of cops. Oh, oh. Melissa! What was that for? What? What'd she do? What are we gonna do with he him? He threw something at him. You're already a convicted criminal, please. Talk to me, please. I'm freaking out. Do you think maybe there was someone in the store who maybe can vouch for you? They oh. said, let's just take him back to the house. He knocked out for a while. <laughs> no, this, this store was pretty empty that day. 
Maybe that was the test to see if she was gonna, if he was gonna say, let's let's kill him and do something with his body. Maybe she was testing him to see how he'll react, so that way she'll know if he's really a murderer or not. Is that? What is that? You? You just got money lying around the place. And this much of it? It's Jacob's. He's kind of weird. He goes to the bank and withdraws a bunch of money and then, like, leaves it in random places. What if he was part of the the, the, the thief or the, the robbery that happened and that girl had all that cash and that bag? Mm. Maybe, um, maybe he ain't about the right. That's oh, interesting. I stuff about him now. Hey, you must be hungry, huh? I mean, it's been a really long day. Yeah, uh, I think I'm gonna grab some Panda Express. Yeah, no, it's, that sounds great. Why don't you do that? And uh, I think I'll be able to take care of Jacob right here on my own. That's some swing you got there. <laughs> yeah, but I'll just be right back. Okay. What are you about to do? There's gotta be evidence in here somewhere. So he he probably set him up so he could get with his girl. Ha! Leaving money in random places, huh? This is our guy caught red-handed. Wakey, wakey, Jakey. Dom! 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 Oh, please, please just, oh, man, whatever you need, just tell me. <laughs> what is all this money doing in the house? I don't know, Melissa's a little careless sometimes. I don't know. This isn't Melissa. I know it's you. She told me. I, I don't. It's not me. I'm... Come on now. You're the one who set me up, aren't you? You just wanted Melissa all to yourself. No, no, look, uh, I don't even know. He getting slapped with money and screaming like a girl, man. <laughs> Since a little after you went to prison, I promise. Can you get my phone, please? No, you're just going to call nope. the cops. I'm not going to call the cops. Look, my, my code is 2228. You can look at it if you want. Two, 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 eight. Two extra two, eight. Be on the lookout. Convicted murderer Dom Matthews is on the loose again at a Panda Express. This is 48 hours after his escape. Two people are in critical condition. That can't be right. You're standing right in front of me. Dang, so it might not be him, but it's somebody just making up these things and he, somehow he's connected to it. It's crazy. Melissa, she was at Panda Express. So don't tell me Melissa was the one who robbed the store and set him up right there. And then now he told Melissa to go to Panda Express. And now it's Melissa. Oh my gosh, what? I wouldn't have suspected, bro. Oh no, she she could be in danger. Look, we we gotta do something. She the one no. He's the one. His own girlfriend, bro. Hey, you okay? Yeah, did something happen? A lot happened. He got uh, she got those first, shoes. Uh, those them shoes. That criminal struck again and <sighs> we were worried about you, but at least we know now that Dom is innocent. Oh, so he was actually telling the truth. Are you? I'm exhausted. And look I have at her. Appetite. Look at how she you acted. You two should definitely eat. I'm going to head to bed. Um, 
What's Dom, in that bag? You can stay on the couch tonight. You rob Panda Dom? Express? Mm -hmm. Shh. Sure. Thank you. Hey, Dom, Dom, do, uh, do, do you think you could, um, you know, l let me loose a little bit, please? Yeah. Cool. Now that you know that I'm innocent. Yeah, of course. <laughs> How could she do this to me? I thought Dang, she... and her boyfriend didn't catch on to it, though. Like, he didn't catch on when he said, oh, she's at Panda Express. And he talking about something, gotta make sure she okay. You didn't catch on to what he caught on to? She loved me. But does that even matter? She's not a good person if she actually did these things. Yeah, Why she... Why would she? No. None of the... None of and she, the way she looked when she uh, knocked her boyfriend out too, like, she, nah, something wrong with her. None of this makes any sense. Maybe it's not her after all. Yeah. You could be overthinking this thing. Nah, bro, it's her. It's her. Yeah. Just calm down. Take a deep breath. Try to get some sleep. Oh. oh. Whoa! Whoa, Jacob! Jacob, help! I'm being attacked! Hey! Get your oh. arms behind their back! Oh. We got him! This, shall we? Get the mask off. Melissa! Oh, she, oh, she gonna say no, but, but girl, he knew it was you. Man, no, no, no. Jacob, <laughs> Jacob, call the cops. I don't think she's herself. She's not herself. I can tell you that right now. Melissa. She's something wrong with her. I think she got, she got, might have like some type of thing to where she go out of, out of reality or something. Are you there? No, she's not there. Look at her. She's just trying to kill you. She's going into you. Go crazy. You tried to kill me. Hex, nah. You no. Know, a year later. It's crazy. We both loved a girl that ended up having split personality disorder. Dang. That's what I wanted to say. That's what I was trying to get out. She got split personality disorder, bro. Poor thing. She didn't know she had it herself. No, I'm not even mad that I went to jail those two years. Really? Yeah, the Melissa I know didn't do that. That was, that was someone else. Yeah, oh, wow. That oh, that's crazy. So, you do anything for Valentine's Day? No, <laughs> no, 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 no. After everything that happened, I think I'll steer clear of relationships for a while. Yeah. Sounds about right. Uh, what, about, what about you? Eh, uh, I... I thought about going to visit Melissa at the ward, and I was like, nah, it's not happening. I ain't feeling that. I thought about doing the exact same thing, dude. Really? I just chickened out at the last minute. Yeah, I just couldn't do it. Wow. Great minds think alike, huh? They really do. That's crazy. I like how they can become bite. friends. Yes, please. Anything to distract me from Melissa right now. Sounds good to me, too. Anything but Panda Express. <laughs> but see, that's the thing. If she didn't know she had split personality disorder and all these things were popping up while she was at Panda, then she come back act acting super weird. She had to know something was wrong with her. You get what I'm saying? It don't make sense. But thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I'll be back with more videos, and I'm out.